In this tutorial, you will learn how to burn a CD or DVD using Windows 8. If you are using Windows 8, you won't need any third-party software to burn your CD or DVD. However, you will need to make sure your computer itself is equipped for CD or DVD burning. It should have a media burner supported by your correspondent drivers. Thus, if you are using a netbook, you will need to attach to it an external CD and DVD driver with CD and DVD burning options. If you have all the prerequisites in place, do the following. Log in to your Windows 8 account and insert your blank CD or DVD into the media drive. The quality of a burned CD or DVD depends on several things. The brand of CD or DVD, the brand of media drive, and the size of data you need to write on the CD or DVD. The longer is the writing process, the longer the disk is exposed to a possible error. From the desktop screen, choose File Explorer. Click your computer icon from the left of it. In the New Computer window, your empty DVD or CD should be seen under Devices. Double-click it. You will see a Burn a Disk box appearing. Type in a name to your CD or DVD in the Disk Title field, and from the CD DVD Usage options, choose with a CD DVD player. Click Next. It's time to add the contents to your future CD or DVD. Copy the contents from their folder and paste them into the blank CD DVD window, or simply drag the contents there. Right-click the white area of the window. From the displayed context menu, click Burn to Disk. In the Burn to Disk box, select the desired recording speed. Usually, the slower is the burning speed, the better is the quality of data writing on the CD or DVD. However, when in a hurry or when you're burning a large number of CDs or DVDs, you can choose a faster speed. Click Next to start burning your CD or DVD. The process can take from several minutes to half an hour, depending on the speed of the media drive and current data encodings going on. Quantity of data and format of files matter. When your CD or DVD is ready, you can take it out. Check your CD or DVD by opening it on your computer, or to be completely sure, on several computers. A couple of words about CD or DVD burning issues. The reasons for burned CD or DVD not playing can be various, but here are the most common mistakes you'd want to avoid. If you are burning your CD or DVD on an unstable surface, in the car, keeping the laptop on your lap, etc., it can produce DVD or CD writing mistakes. Same goes for an unstable electrical signal in the computer. If your computer is connected to a power supply that is not constant, any electrical variation in the electrical network or damaged computer cord, this can offer you an uneven media writing. Inspect your CD or DVD. If the CD or DVD itself has scratches or is kept in a dusty environment, it could also produce writing errors. With all these processions mentioned, we're sure we will have a great CD and DVD burning session on Windows 8. This was a How Tech tutorial. Like us on Facebook, love us forever, or leave us a comment here in the fields below. Thanks for watching.